morning, Empire Oak students. This is Mrs. Perenzen, Chloe, Rita, Riley, and Emma with your Monday morning message. Hi, I'm Chloe Kazarian, your new Sergeant at Arms. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. This week's Sunday story is called Spookly the Square Pumpkin, and it is read to you by kindergarten teacher Mrs. Ray Hall, so please check that out when you have time this week. Hi, I'm Rita Ramsey with your special events this week. And here are the boosters on our plate. Congratulations, Empire Oaks. We have reached our goal of $10,000 and even went over it. That is truly amazing. Also, this Saturday is our drive through Fall Festival event. It'll be just like last year's with cool decorated cars. It'll be from 6 to 8 p.m. All right, students, here is our second step message for the week. Remember that for the whole month of October, we are focused on the skill of responsibility. And this week's uh, message has to do with the skill for learning, focusing your attention and staying on task. So a few weeks ago, we discussed how to focus our attention and listen. And if you remember, it sounds like this, eyes watching, ears listening, voice quiet, and body still. So today, I'm going to give you one more strategy to stay focused and on task with a tool from your student utility belt. And this tool is called an attentoscope. So I want you to curl your fingers and thumbs on each hand to form a circle like this. So you have two circles. And then you're going to place your hands on top of your eye. Oh, you're just gonna use one of them. Place both hands on top of one eye, like a telescope, right? Sometimes we do this with our attentoscope, almost like binoculars. Um, but you can do that and try to look at something or focus on something in your classroom. Kind of look around. See how easy it is to focus on something when you block out other distractions? When you are trying to stay focused, but you find yourself getting distracted, use your hands to make an attentoscope and redirect your energy to whatever activity you are supposed to be working on. So this week's challenge is to use your attentoscope, and that can look like this or like this, if you wanna use one eye. Use your attentoscope when it's time to work in class and stay focused and on task. Don't use it all the time, just when you feel like you're beginning to get distracted and you need to make sure that your eyes are focused on what the teacher has asked you to do. All right, boys and girls. So that is a tool for you to use to stay focused and on task, the attentoscope. All right, nice job. This week's quote is, you were made to be real, not perfect. Bye, acorns. Hi, students. I'm Emma, your treasurer here again. I wanted to say is that on Friday, we have Spirit Day. So you can wear good vibe shirts and pyro shirts or navy and white shirts. Have a good day. That's it for this week's announcements. Students, stay positive, stay healthy, stay safe, and have a wonderful week.